Well, there's a lot to show and tell regarding this accident. First of all, let me show you what's right behind me on Route 51. That white powder you see there, that's dry cement that spilled onto 51 as the tractor trailer took that exit off of 79. And just above, you still see the tractor trailer leaned over the guardrail. Now, let's take a look at more video as we explain how this accident occurred. State police are telling us that the tractor trailer traveled southbound on 79 took the exit for Route 51, but then lost control, hit the guardrail, tipped over, and then hit the guardrail. That's when the trailer split open and that dried cement hit Route 51. The DEP is telling us that it is a hazardous material because it can cause skin irritation and respiratory problems if inhaled. So now they're beginning the process of cleaning it up and it will take several hours. Now let's take a look at the problems this accident caused on 79 South. The backup is enormous, and as a result, you had some oncoming traffic rear-ending the backflow on 79. And there you can see some of the ambulances on the scene taking some of those people away. In the meantime, state police are telling us, or rather the DEP, that a company called Weaver Town Environmental is in charge of the cleanup. They specialize in chemical spills and accidents of this nature. So it'll be a while, and hopefully we'll have more information beginning at 5 o'clock tonight. Route 51 is shut down as well as 79 South. Reporting live, Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.